guys so today I'm going to be showing you my Target collective haul it's like health type um, beauty slash household items it's not all body care or anything like that I'm just trying to stock up on some of the usual things that I get on a um, you know weekly to monthly basis that I use and um, usually get from Target and some of the items that I really like from there a few couple things that I'm trying out so um definitely watch my unboxing and enjoy all right guys so I just got this order usually when you order from Target they send it in multiple packages so I'm not sure what's in this one but um I did do um some like hygiene products household stuff like that so i thought i'd show you what i got so this was dropped off by ups which a lot of times they will ship by either ups or they also do fedex and sometimes they come on the same day from different shipping services my order was quite large but today I received this shipment from UPS and it looks like I only have a couple things in this box. So um, I got the Natural Care Gentle Clean Puppy Soft Dog Shampoo. This one's coconut based, cleanses, gentle formula, moisturizes and protects. It says it's the puppy soft scent. Um, what? Oh, it does say it's made with goat milk, moisturizes and protects. So, um, my little dog, she has skin issues, so they did have, like, itch relief ones, but I thought that they might actually be too harsh for my dog because she is really sensitive. Even though she's not a puppy, she has really sensitive skin, so that's why I went with the puppy shampoo, so we're going to see how that works. Right now, she's using a different natural, um based soap basically that we got from a specialized pet store but I thought I'd try to something from Target this time instead. I tried some stuff from Walmart before and it actually made her worse so um in some different brands but we'll see how this one does. This is a pretty large bottle. It is 20 fluorid ounces. I believe it was like I don't know I think it was either it was like seven to nine dollars. And then the only other thing that I received in this is this um, Revlon lipstick. And it is in 025 Skyline Pink. It's the Revlon Super Lustrous Lipstick Pearl. So we're going to see how that one works out. I haven't really tried a whole lot of lipsticks but um, I always like to have a light or nude lip and then do dark eyes. So I'm going to go ahead and see how this one works for me. And I will have more packages coming that I will put into this video as well because this is definitely not my full order. Like I said, Target ships in multiple packages when you do a single order a lot of times. So I will probably be receiving some packages over the next few days. There's the top of this. You can see right through the top. I didn't even realize that. But it looks like a nice shade. It's um, hard to tell from pictures online and also just looking at it until you actually get it on your lips. So we'll see if I receive a FedEx package of any more Target stuff today as well. All right, guys. So... Um, I did receive another package from Target today, the same day as I got the UPS package. This one was shipped by FedEx. So like I was saying, um, they ship in multiple packages and they're usually shipped either by UPS or FedEx. So I did receive two of my Target order packages today from different carriers ups and then fedex so i'm gonna go ahead and open it up and show you guys what i got all right so as you guys can see there's a whole lot of bubble wrap on the top so it's a little 
This is like the weird type of bubble wrap nowadays. There you go. It's like square little packets and then this usual bubble wrap that they go. Okay, so all that's in this humongous box is one tissue box, which is pretty crazy. I was thinking it was quite light, but um, wow, that's crazy. They FedExed one box of tissue in this like huge box and this was like one dollar and something but this was only one piece of my order i ordered way more than this but like i said it comes in multiple packages when you order from target and this is just their brand up and up i don't know i think it was like 150 or something but that's all i got for today so i'm guessing i will not get any more Target packages today, but I will show you the rest of my haul when it comes. All right, so this is another package that we got from the Target order, and it's the third package we got from the order, the one order that we did. They ship in multiple boxes and from multiple carriers. We got a UPS one and a FedEx one yesterday, and this one was actually supposed to arrive yesterday as well but um it did not it was delayed and they sent a email confirming that it was delayed and it was going to be delivered today which it was and this one was delivered by ups so i'm going to go ahead and unbox it and show you what is inside all right so we got a few things in this one i don't think this is our complete order i think we are still expecting at least one more package to arrive from our order but um they did put some air pocketing and padding in here, so I'm going to remove that. Alright, and so this is the Too Faced that we get pretty much all the time, or the one that I use, is the Hello brand, and this is from Target Anti-Plaque and Whitening Fluoride-Free Toothpaste. I think you can find it at different places as well, but the place that I get it all the time and they always have it is Target. Um, this is the only one that basically helps my gums and doesn't make them hurt because I have very, very sensitive gums. And it's natural peppermint with tea tree and coconut oil. So, whitens teeth, removes plaque, crushes tartar, mind-blowing freshness. It's vegan, no peroxide, no, no artificial sweeteners, no dyes, no SLS sulfates, no brainer. So, yeah, I... I've been using this one for quite a while, so I keep reordering that. Okay, next I have not tried this before. So this is um just regular Epsom salt. I usually always get the Epsom salt with the eucalyptus, like the eucalyptus kind. But um, I just want to try the plain one this time. And this was a really good deal. It was like... Um, I think it was like three fifty or something for this big huge one. The other ones were like five bucks for ones that had less. I believe this one is like how many pounds is this thing? So this is four pounds. The other ones were three pounds. The scented ones by the Up and Up brand, which is a brand that Target puts out, I believe. And um, the scented ones, like the eucalyptus, the lavender, all those ones, those were like. I think they were like $4.99. This one was like $3.50 and you got a pound more. And I kind of just didn't really want a scent. And so I could possibly mix it with oil or bubble bath or something like that. So it's just normal Epsom salt. So magnesium sulfate USP. Saline laxative helps relieve occasional digestive distress. Soaking solution helps ease sore, sore and tired muscles. Which I use it for the soaking solution to help ease sore and tired muscles. I've never used it for a laxative, so I don't know if you guys have used this for a laxative. Let me know in the comments. All right, this is the um, some cleaning products. So it's just um, Clorox bleach, just the normal disinfecting bleach. I use this to mop with, and I'm also going to use it to. Um, 
wash the towels in because I have really, really sensitive skin. And so my skin needs to be, um, I don't know. I've just been having issues with the towels I've been using. So I'm going to start bleaching my towels. And that's also why I got white towels. So yeah, the regular, just a regular disinfecting cloth bleach. I'll also use this to mop with. It works really, really good. I just put um, warm water and um, just a little bit of this. And then when you mop and it makes it really clean, disinfects, it gets grime off and stuff. Okay, so this is the... This is the... Oh, I can't get this open now. Um, let's see, I can't get it open. Let's try to open that first. So this is the laundry detergent we've been using, and we have reordered this several times. It's just the Target brand. It's the Up and Up, which is, I believe, put out by target um i don't think you can find that anywhere else besides target but it's been working really good for us it's actually worked better than some of the name brand stuff that we've tried that is uh, more like for sensitive skin and um this one we get i think they have other ones too but um we all kind of have sensitive skin so we get the free and clear laundry detergent dye free and fragrance free power juice stains to whiten and brighten and it's 64 loads this was like 7.99 but it lasts us quite a while so it's a pretty good deal and yeah we've reordered the same product several times this was pretty good for us my family all right then we got some good old pampers sensitive baby wipes and um these are really good for just personal use basically like if you need to clean up down there and you don't want to take a shower or anything these work really really good so I keep these around they're also good for like if you need a face wipe real quick or something like that like if my kids get some on their face you can wipe them up real quick without having to just use a washcloth or something like that or give them a bath but yeah especially for your lady parts if you um if you use it down there just if you're not feeling so fresh you can use one of these and it feels a lot better so definitely had to restock on some baby wipes these are the fragrance free ones um, for sensitive skin all right and then i just got a couple of towels let's see this is so this is the room essentials hand towels so this was a two pack and these were three dollars not three dollars each it was three dollars for two so like 150 each so i'm going to try these out we needed some more towels and so i ordered washcloths towels hand towels so we didn't get all our order yet we're still expecting the washcloths and some more towels but um i got two different versions of white towels so we'll see how that goes so yeah these were pretty affordable for sure it was like three bucks for a two pack and got all white so we can bleach everything and kill any germs okay and then these are the everyday bath towels so these are like the step up from the three dollar ones i believe these ones were five dollars each and i also got some of the three dollar bath towels as well but those have not come yet so i'm going to test like both of those and see which one's better so this is 100% cotton and low lint, everyday bath towel, room essentials. Um, I think room essentials, you can only get that from Target as well. But I really like the Target brands, the up and up, the room essentials. Those seem all right to me. Let me know if you like Target brands as well. And those are both the same. So I think these were like five bucks each per piece. It wasn't like a two pack or nothing. So that is what came today in our 
and for our target order so that is a piece of our haul i believe we have like one last box coming from our order which i will show you next time all right so the last thing i did not see this it was at the very bottom of the package but this is um the maybelline eyeshadow and i always use this one and i ran out and i had been using a different white eyeshadow and then i ran out of that one but i always use this for like highlighter around my eyes so i thought i would share my last item with you that i almost missed and probably almost threw away so i received another package from my target order i believe this is like the fourth one so i'm going to go ahead and show you what's inside it's a rainy day so fortunately fedex actually put this in a plastic bag before or on my porch so that was nice i'm gonna go ahead and show you what is inside all right so here's the washcloths that i ordered i already showed you guys the hand towels and also a couple of the bath towels so this was three dollars for six of these washcloths so that's not a bad deal at all so i'll go ahead and use these and see what the quality is actually like if they hold up hopefully they say that they're 100 percent cotton and um they're by room essentials which is i believe a target brand all right so now it looks like um these are separately packaged which is kind of odd so these are the towels these are the other towels that I ordered. So I ordered um, the everyday bath towels and then just the normal bath towels. I believe these ones were the ones that were $3 a piece. The other ones I ordered were 5 So I'm going to see what the difference is, see if one is actually better or not or whatever. They're both by Room Essentials, 100% cotton loops, it says. So we'll see how this works out. I have very sensitive skin, so I got all white so that I can bleach them, like I said before. So there's one towel. And another towel. Same thing. So these are the $3 ones from Target, the bath towels. Try those out. All right, and then so I just got some cotton swabs. These are just the Up and Up brand, which is a Target brand, I believe. They're the paper sticks. I hate the um, plastic sticks. Do not get the plastic sticks because they hurt if they hit your ear. If they don't put enough cotton on the on the swabs, then they do hurt your ears so I always get the paper sticks and this up and up brand is just as good as the um q-tip brand because I usually go with a q-tip brand but when I found these ones these are just as good and I got 500 of them and I believe it was like less than three dollars it's a pretty good deal just the regular kind okay then I got this uh deodorant this is for my husband he always uses this kind the degree ultra clear black and white this is like the one he always uses so we reorder it so he has more like every time all right and i got this hair dye this is the one i've been using i used to just use the black the revlon hair dyes are only like three dollars and something like three dollars and some change they're almost four but um, they work pretty well. They're permanent hair dyes. It says 100% gray coverage, ammonia free. They're the color silks. So um, I used to just get the black, but now I'm trying to kind of fade in the deep burgundy. And so my roots are more like this color. And then this actually doesn't really dye the black part at all, but it's I'm going for hopefully like an ombre effect once my roots grow out a little bit more, but we'll see, but not like a super ombre effect. Hopefully it'll just kind of fade into each other. We'll see. And the last thing I got is 
a lot of you guys might have this one right now. This is a limited edition scent of the Glade spray, Apple of My Pie. So we needed like an air freshener for our bathroom. Just a spray. I have kids and yeah, we definitely needed something. So I just went with a Glade spray. Um, yeah, it's apple in my pie, notes of apple, cinnamon, and nutmeg. So I've never had this one, but it is a seasonal scent. So um, if I like this, I might get the candles to go with it because I love candles, but we'll see. We'll see how this smells. All right, so I thought I would just go ahead and talk about a couple of the items that um, came from my Target haul. So, um, first of all, I want to talk about the towels. I am really liking the towels. Um, I'm not finding much of a difference between the bath towels. I got the, like, the $5 each bath towel that I thought was going to be, you know, a little bit better than the $3 bath towel. And I went on Target, though, again, and they have raised the price on the $3 towels so now it's 350 for those towels as well as 350 for a pack of six washcloths and 350 for the hand towels so it is 350 instead of three dollars i got mine for three dollars like the week before that they raised these prices so i am really enjoying the white towels though because i can bleach them with the corox bleach that i also got from the target haul here that i showed you and um my detergent, I haven't opened it yet, but I'm still using the same exact kind. That's just a backup. So I get the fragrance-free one in the Up and Up brand, and I really like that one. It feels like it cleans better than a lot of other detergents, and it does not break my skin out. It makes my skin um, feel good. My skin's very sensitive, and that is part of the reason I do have to now get white towels and bleach them so I can kill any germs and everything. So that I won't have skin problems. So yeah, I'm really loving the bleach towels. It makes me feel like I'm like in a hotel or something. So I'm definitely going to continue that and get some more white towels so that um, we can all enjoy having freshly bleached towels um, at our baths and showers. So that is one thing I'm really enjoying from my haul. All right, and it, I know it's mainly just kind of like a household haul. It might be kind of boring for you guys, but I wanted to do something a little bit different and show you kind of just what I get, you know, use on an everyday basis. Okay, so I also got the Hello um, toothpaste, which I use this all the time. This is pretty much the only one I use because when I go to use a different toothpaste, then it um, hurts my teeth. It hurts my gums. And so, so yeah, I just um, have to stick with this one. And that's okay, though, because I'm really liking this one. It's anti-plaque plus whitening fluoride-free toothpaste. It's natural peppermint with tea tree and coconut oil. I've been using this one for quite some time. So, um, yeah, I've been using it for... Gosh, I don't know, probably almost a year now, but this one definitely makes my gums feel better. I have recessive gums, so they become really, really, really sensitive to certain products, and fluoride might be one of those products that does cause sensitivity, so I'm in no way, shape, or form recommending you get a fluoride-free toothpaste. Um, it has significantly helped me. Um, Hello also makes fluoride toothpaste as well. So, I mean, what's right for me might not be right for you. So go ahead, you know, you do your own research, ask your doctors, whatever. But I am really enjoying this product. And again, this was a backup. This is the one that I had already. And my backup is still in the box under this thing. And so I'm just waiting for this one to run out so I can use that one. Because like I said, I need a backup of some of these items because... I'm a very sensitive person. I don't want to just run out and get something. Um, I can't just run out and get anything. I need like certain sensitive products for myself. So that's why I do like to get backups. All right. So I tried this Epsom salt. 
and I've only had one bath with this so far and it, there's no scent to it whatsoever. I used to get the eucalyptus one, um, like the Walgreens brand eucalyptus one, which I really liked, but I don't know. I was kind of getting tired of the scent. And then when I get out and I put lotion on or something, the eucalyptus kind of clashes with my lotion because I'm more of a gourmand scent lover and like gourmand vanilla does not really go with eucalyptus. So, so it's kind of clashy. So, um, I definitely, I just wanted to try the normal, um, Epsom salt and it did feel like it helped my muscles. The main point of using Epsom salt for me is to help any muscle soreness that I get, which I do get some soreness. Um, I'm a mom, I am on my feet a lot. I'm doing lots and lots of stuff all the time. So I get sore and it says right here, soaking solution helps ease sore and tired muscles. So the Up and Up brand is a Target brand. They also do have like the eucalyptus one, I think. They have lavender. They might have even another one as well. So they do have some fragranced ones. This was a really good deal because this is, this is four pounds. So this is four pounds of Epsom salt. If you can tell, this is bigger than like the, the three pound ones they usually give, the three pound ones with um, the, scent okay so this is like a pound more and this was like three something the scented ones that were the up and up brand were like 4.99 so i mean it's not that bad if you like the scent one go for it you know that is a good price still but for me i want to try just the regular ones i do have kids as well so i thought you know a normal epsom salt might be better for them as well because sometimes they use it now it says here on it that it's a Saline laxative helps receive occasional digestive distress. I've never used it in that way. If you guys have used this, like her Epsom salt, any Epsom salt as a digestive product, like internally, let me know in the comments and let me know how it worked out for you because I'm interested. I've never heard that. And I had no idea you could like drink or eat the Epsom salt. Okay. I had no idea. So let me know in the comments if you've ever heard of that, done that, tried that, how did it work out? <laughs> All right, so on to the next. Um, I'm going to just show this really quickly. I've been using this already, so it's already kind of tore up. I always try to keep a, one of these around. I am a big fan of Maybelline. If you've watched some of my videos, my Get Ready video or anything like that, you'll see that, you know, I use the foundation and whatnot. I'm a big fan of Maybelline usually. And I love these little singles. They're usually not too badly priced. It's like $3.99 for one. Um, I always try to keep the white one around because I don't know if you can tell or not on the video, but I use it as a highlighter in the corner of my eyes and also like right here. So pretty much when I'm getting ready and I apply my makeup, before I apply any other eye makeup, like I put my foundation on and then I put this all over my whole entire eye, you know, the whole eyelid up here. And then after that, I start shading, like I'll start shading with a different um, eyeshadow and then, you know, your eyes, the little eyeliner, the brows, all that stuff. So I use this yeah, as a highlighter and it's wonderful. It stays on pretty much all day. Um, so yeah, I definitely recommend that. I use even the little single for my eyebrows. I have like the brown one and I just use a single and like an angle brush to do my eyebrows. So I definitely recommend these little Maybelline singles. They have really good staying power and you can blend them well and yeah, they stick around all day. So the quality of these is quite nice to me. And I have repurchased these many times. I've probably repurchased this white one. Like I can't even count how many times because it's one of my favorite products and I always use it. <laughs> all right. So I think the last thing I'm going to talk about for my Target haul is just this. This apple of my pie spray. All right, so this is a spray by Glade. This, I believe, is a um, 
it's a, like a holiday scent. So on it, it says limited edition right there. If you can see limited edition and it's notes of apple, cinnamon, and nutmeg. Okay. It says fragrance infused with essential oils. And this is just a regular glade spray. And you guys, these are awesome. Um, I like these in, in the bathroom. <laughs> Mostly in the bathroom because then, you know, when you go, if it's a little stinky, just blast a little of this and nobody will even know. They just smell, smell, you know, the goodness. <laughs> they don't have to smell the stink anymore and complain or whatever. So, yeah, I definitely recommend the glade sprays the limited edition ones this is october so yeah i picked this one up in october i see that they also have the pine one which i'm interested in getting they also have a pumpkin one which i don't know i'm not that interested in getting the pumpkin one for some reason this pumpkin spice one because i think it's because it's almost november now and i'm kind of disassociating from the pumpkin smells um i'm looking more into christmas smells now so that's why i'm looking like i want to get the pine one next so this does say surround yourself with a scent of freshly picked apples grounded in a warm base of cinnamon and nutmeg with apple of my pie and these are like 99 cents okay so i got this shipped to me it was 99 cents i think they have them at walmart and stuff too so yeah, I definitely recommend these for your bathroom. And let me know your favorite scent down below in the comments as well. I would love to know because I might be interested and want to try that out. I also saw that they have like an Irish cream one, but it's not available online. So I'm interested in that, but I can't get a hold of it yet. So let me know if you've tried that one and if it smells really good. Because then I might try to search for it search for it even better try to go to store or something but like I said I do live far away from the stores that's why I have to order in um, shipping and whatnot because I can't just go to Target it's pretty far away from my house but anyway so that's the last thing I'm going to talk about but thank you for joining me in my Target collective kind of household beauty haul and I hope you will stay around and check out my other videos